Hello Sagittarius. This is a reading for Sagittarius singles. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. See how you guys can attract your next love interest here. Let's start with how you guys are currently. Sagittarius, how are my Sagittarius friends currently here? Hmm, a lot of people are getting the Wheel of Fortune in different positions here, but I think you guys are all about um, trying to like change up some things in your life that you feel like were no longer working for you. Um, I think that you feel like um, some changes are necessary for you to be successful even here. Um, a lot of you are working on your money. Uh, you're trying to do right by the people um, in your life currently. Okay. I think a lot of you are trying to be more supportive here, trying to work on um, being a little more grounded, stable um, with the Wheel of Fortune. Hmm. Some of you guys are currently dealing with the Scorpio, Taurus, Aquarius, or Leo energy, or you know that is um, probably what was significant to you or is significant to you, um, those energies. Let's see what kind of person you normally attract here. I think you guys usually attract people that um, really don't know what they want. Um, I think they have a hard time being decisive. I think they see what they want to see a lot of the time. I think a lot of um, the people that you deal with um, may hide their feelings from you hmm I think maybe this person is always um, or these people that you seem to attract um, maybe they have like an aggressive tendency um, and I think you know the aggression comes from hiding you know what they really believe or what they really think or how they really feel and so they come across as um, aggressive. Some of them actually um, probably not ghost you, but some of them probably ignore you sometimes. Okay. Libra energy there. Let's see what you guys need to show more of here with your personality. My Sagittarius. Hmm. That you can do what's right. Okay. That you can be open and honest. That you can initiate conversations and, and very logical conversations here. Okay. That you're not just you know, all over the place, that you can be stable, grounded, and, um, you know, speak the truth. Hmm. That you're just, you know, that you are in it to win it, win it, that you can be victorious here, that you're not just out for yourself. You're not out to break hearts. You're not out to hurt people. You know, I think this is you not only being true to yourself, but being true to other people and really displaying that. Okay. Let's see what you need. You guys need to contribute here. What do my Sagittarius need to contribute? Hmm. More lightheartedness for sure. Um, I think more accountability. Uh, being responsible for your your own actions. I think that um, you need to show more confidence here. Hmm. I think that um, you guys need to really contribute um, yourself. Show togetherness in your relationships. 
Show that you can be there. Show that you can be happy being there, that you're not going anywhere. Show that you're grounded, that you can establish foundations and be there, that you're not flighty if some people view you as that, if that's been an issue for you before. Okay. What do Sagittarius need to accept about themselves? What do Sagittarius need to accept about themselves? Hmm. I feel that, you know, you guys um, come off a little arrogant sometimes that you just don't give a shit. <laughs> um, this is how people view you that um, you just you don't give a shit that you're all about having a good time and um, maybe what other people can do for you you like that um, when people show you affection but sometimes you can come off like you just don't give a shit you know let's see how <clears throat> what kind of love you guys need? What kind of love does Sagittarius need? What kind of love does Sagittarius need here? Hmm. One that's committed. One that where they can establish a legacy. One where they can establish um, a foundation. One that is lasting. I feel Virgo energy here. Somebody that can keep you grounded. Also that you feel like, um, you know, you would be happy to be there with them. Stationary, <laughs> you know. Okay. Let's see if you guys are ready for love. Is my Sagittarius ready for love? Is Sagittarius ready for love? I think you guys are still trying to figure out if this is what you want. I feel that um, a lot of you are not are not emotionally available right now. I think that you're really um, I think you're really working on um, some of you are studying. Some of you are into your jobs. Um, maybe some of you are lawyers, um, judges, police officers, where you keep, you know, keep these hours where you don't have a lot of time for something that is, um, that will tie you down. I think that, you know, for the most part, this is you guys, you know, you're basically, you're trying to concentrate on yourself here. And I don't think that you're really, you know, at this point, open to just giving all of yourself. Okay? I think that is coming, though, for sure. I think that is definitely coming. Okay? But I don't think you're really that receptive to it at this moment. Let's see how you guys will find love. Hmm. By allowing it in. By deciding that, hey, yeah, I do want to be in a relationship. Yes, I can be all in. Yes, I can be emotionally available. I do give a shit. And not just saying, you know, a oh, will. You know, it is what it is right now. I have way too much going on. Just kind of taking your hand off the love wheel. Okay? Put your hands back on the wheel. <laughs> okay. Decide that it is what you want. You know. Let's see what attributes should Sagittarius next partner have for my singles. Sagittarius. Open to love. Maybe not flooding you with emotions. Maybe not, um, you know, Wanting to get married right away. Just want to date. See where it goes. Somebody that takes it slow. 
okay I feel Piscean energy there let's see what else yeah Pisces mm -hmm. somebody that feels like um, I think you guys are not really interested in long term just yet so I feel like your next partner is going to be on the same page with you um, they want to be like totally you know fulfilled but they don't necessarily they're not necessarily looking here for a very committed relationship they may just enjoy spending time with you and that's enough for them okay so I feel strong Pisces for you guys um, I feel like coming in probably towards the end of the year Piscean energy where you know you guys probably will vibe together be on the same you know wavelength where you know neither one of you are going into the situation thinking oh I want to marry this person oh I want to be with this person long term but I get the feeling when you meet this person that's what it's going to lead to because neither one of you are putting like absolutes on the connection okay so my Sagittarius that's what I have for you guys and I will be speaking with you soon